Yep. All right, so the cam angle sensor has the two screws, the one here and then the one in the back. Once you get it a little tight, it will come off finger tight. And it just fits. I better take that all the way off, actually. Should wiggle right out, right? Yeah, it does. It's just very, very tight space. And also very hot. Don't drop it, don't drop it, don't drop it. That long screw comes out. And now your cam angle sensor will come straight out. Try not to drop it though. Just straight out. Straight out. It's coming straight out. Any minute. All right, so I don't know if you guys can see that, but it has a really small crack in it. Now we're having problems getting it pulled out behind the valve cover, so we're just gonna remove it here and put the new gasket on. And this is the gasket, all cracked. Oh, oh my God. all cracked up and gone forever. Then gone forever. So she was a good O-ring. Yep. This is the uh, part number and the new part. If it focuses in, we're just gonna, like I said, we're gonna um, slap it on over the cam angle sensor and put it in. This one you can tell is a lot thicker and that's not squared. worn out and squared on the edges. Oh, here we have your old one here. Yeah, you can see it. Is that mine? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we actually just did this on my car, my Miata, and. Uh, uh, same same idea. We're just gonna get that on. Quick recap: we uh, we're going to end up taking the valve cover back off uh, to line up the keyway notches on the cam angle sensor uh, because it's very very difficult to see it see it and line it up. Okay, so now we got all the bolts removed on the uh, valve cover. Just gonna fold it back, keep the gasket intact, because we uh, we just recently replaced this gasket like I don't know, less than a thousand miles ago. Maybe more. I don't know. Eric does quite a bit of uh, commuting. Spirited driving. All right. All right. So the purpose of this is, if you look, and oh, actually did we it. did have it lined up. Oh, no, we didn't. We had it incorrect. Just barely, barely off. off. So that's how sensitive this is. There's, if you can, let me try to focus in on this. How do I? So if I can zoom in on this, there's a keyway slot that he's trying to line up. With the cam angle sensor. Yeah, so it's. Oh, it just gets caught on itself. Sorry, I'm gonna block the shot for just a second. That's okay. Like a super tight fit. And it has to... There it goes. Oh, I missed it. Okay, now you're in. The angle's in. Yep. Yep. 
So I'm good. I just gotta get it pull pull forward if you can. See that little keyway? Yeah! You got it? Yep, there we go. And now we made a notch on top here. Yep. So if you see this his model, mine has a notch, but his we had to notch right. You want to point to it because it's not yep. really so right enough. here, it's kind of hard to see. It's a little scratch to line, to line up with up this. To this arrow. So obviously you don't want to go like, because that's off. Right. There you go. Line it up right there. Now we'll put our stuff back on. See you in a second. Back to our binder. Where did we put it? Let's try. So we're not really sure, like, torque specs on this or anything. So what we... Um, decided was obviously just start with your middle uh, to evenly dis distribute the uh, gasket and just finger tight and then go all the way around and and uh, we're gonna we're gonna start here and do like a crisscross pattern um, when we tighten it all up 